This is a bee that is about to die. She's not one of my bees. She comes from another hive. I'm squeezing her a little hard so she's regurgitating a little bit. Um, the reason she is going to die is because she's currently too weak to fly and she needs an energy reset in order to make it back to her hive. I want to show you her little bottom right there. And a little face. So this is a female worker bee. You can see her little head quite clearly there. And then she's got oh, if I can get it to focus, she's got six little legs. You can see the three on the left side moving around and two antennae. And let's see if we can get this to happen. So she is very unlikely to sting me right now. And the reason that she is unlikely to sting me is that bees sting for two reasons. The first reason is if you get in the hive, they want to protect their queen. So anyone that's not a beekeeper shouldn't be stung for that situation. And the other reason that she is very unlikely to sting me is because I'm not hurting her in any way. So the main reason that bees sting is to protect the queen. And she is nowhere near her queen because she's out scavenging and therefore doesn't need to protect her queen. So she's not being aggressive at all to me. I can show you, I can lay her on my hand and she'll just crawl around. And then I'm also, I'm not hurting her, even though I'm squeezing her a little bit, she's not in pain. So usually when pain comes, um, it's when you accidentally squish a bee. So like they get in between um, your knee the folds of your leg and you squish it and then the reaction is for the stinger to come out it's not intentional but the stinger will come out and she'll sting you you can see there her wings she has two wings on each side and you notice she's not using them she's just too tired and too old to make it back to the hive which happens to just about every bee the majority of the bees die while they're out scavenging because they take turns in life and being a bee that leaves the hive is the very last stage of their life cycle. But this little bee, um, she's just, she doesn't have very long left. If I can get her to do it, I would like to show you her little stinger coming in and out. Um, so I'll try that again. focus. Okay, where are you? There we go. Camera focus. Now her stinger. Oop. Focus please. There we go. Her stinger comes right from there. Right in her little bottom. Um, you can See right here, a tiny, oh, and we got it to come out, a tiny little bit of her tongue. That's what she uses to collect the nectar from the flowers, which the bees turn into honey. And uh, I think she might even be too tired to stick her stinger out. Let's let her walk around a little bit and we'll see if we can get her to do it. Put her on the inside of 